Until we reach the very heart of enlightenment, we take refuge in all the Buddhas. Likewise, we take refuge in the Dharma and in the Bodhisattva Sangha. Just as the Buddhas of the past first resolved to reach enlightenment and then progressed stage by stage through the different levels of Bodhisattva training, so in the same way we also cultivate a mind intent upon enlightenment for the good of each and every sentient being. We too shall progressively practice that training. Now my life is fruitful. I've achieved true humanity. Today I'm born in the family of Buddhas and today I became heir to the Buddhas. And now, no matter what is required of me, I will act in accord with this, my kindred family, and will never do anything which might sully this faultless, noble line. Just as a blind person might find a jewel among heaps of rubbish, so somehow this bodhicitta has arisen in me. It is the elixir of life produced to vanquish death in the world. It's an inexhaustible treasure eliminating the poverty of the world. It's the supreme medicine that alleviates the illness of the world. It is the tree of rest for beings exhausted from wandering the roads of worldly existence. It is the universal bridge for all travellers to cross over painful states of existence. It is the rising moon of the mind that soothes the mental afflictions of the world. And it's the great sun dispelling the darkness of the world's ignorance. It is the fresh butter formed from churning the milk of Dharma. And for the caravan of beings traveling the plains of worldly existence and starving for the meal of happiness, it is the feast of happiness that satisfies them all. So today, in the presence of all these protectors of beings, I invite each and every sentient being to be my guest at the great celebration of Buddhahood. And my guest to well-being until that enlightenment is achieved. So therefore gods, demigods and others, Really, truly rejoice. Precious Bodhicitta, may it arise in those in whom it has not yet arisen. Wherever it has arisen, may it never, never deteriorate, but progress ever more and more.